A question that can come up on the Facebook group is about publishing and that sometimes when publishing it will get stuck or sometimes some people have said that the um, app will crash on them. I've been pretty lucky. I was surprised because I had a MacBook Air and I have the lowest version of it and then I got into animation. So when I had to buy a new computer, I made sure that I had enough RAM and my graphics card was good. So I did upgrade to a MacBook instead of the MacBook Air. But I thought I would share a few things that um, may help if you are experiencing this. And the first thing is that you should have other apps closed and your browser closed. That way you will have more RAM available and especially if you have other heavy apps that are also competing, you're going to probably have some issues, not just with Create Studio, but with any of the apps that you have open because it is your computer um, speed and resources that will have a lot to do with that. The next thing is just save your project, close it, quit out of Create Studio, and then restart the app. That sometimes can solve issues. I know I rarely even close down my app. It's always open. And if I ever see any sluggishness, usually I think, oh, time to close the app and restart it again. And so can't hurt to also clear your cache because I don't do that enough either. So doing those things may help. But Animation apps need RAM. And now that we have more 3D characters, where in CS Pro we had all of the 3D characters, but now we actually have 360 3D characters, and that's going to need more resources. Also, if you're using a lot of 3D animations, whether it's some of your text, I have these animated with some um, 3D animations with the text that I'm doing. If you're using a lot of the 3D, the 360 3D characters as well as the other 3D characters, and you're putting a lot of actions and animations, you may find it slows down. If you're using um, other heavy files, if you have a lot of transparent files that you have in there, transparent video files, that may slow it down. So you do need to have the RAM for animation. So sometimes it's going to come down to your computer and it isn't the app, but it is what resources are available for you to use Create Studio. And then um, if you can't solve it through those suggestions, then contact support. They're amazing. They they want you to contact them. You can share your project file. I've had to contact them, I think only twice about a project, and um, they even fixed one for me. And I forget about the first one. I don't remember what that was, but um, they can always help and look at your file. So the first thing you want to do, and I should have shown this when I was saying it, here are the minimum system requirements, and this is on their support page. Remember, this is minimum, so you probably want a little bit more, but this is the minimum that would be advised for that. They also do have a page for what happens if rendering is stuck for Windows, so they give you all of this information and how you can make sure you have the permissions and how to get your log that you can also submit to them and with your project file and or the log when you submit a ticket will help them to solve your problem or advise you. They also have a page for Mac, which is much smaller. <laughs> I, I'm a Mac person, so I, I kind of like that. And then you can just go to their, your be on their support page and you can just submit a ticket. Maybe it's the technical. And this would give you a, an opportunity to share um, any files that you want. When I have shared a file with them, I usually have done it through Google Drive or through Dropbox. 
but you can submit a ticket here for any of these um, categories, general, technical, feature request, or if you have a billing question. So let me just get back to Create Studio. I think that was my last um, thought of the day. But hopefully you won't have a lot of these problems, but try these first thing, these first three first, and then just check your computer specs. But always feel free to contact support. They encourage you to, and they are the most amazing support. So you will hear back from them in any case. So I hope this was helpful. As I was loading this on to YouTube, I realized I forgot to mention the old rendering engine and the um, hardware acceleration option that you also can check out. What you can do is right here, you can use the old rendering engine by just clicking that. And that may help with an issue. You also, can turn off this hardware acceleration by clicking the slider. And if you click on here, I can't blow it up, but it sometimes hardware acceleration may sometimes cause issues. And if you encounter rendering issues, please try to turn it off. So I was writing this in the description of the video, but I thought I would return just to also put this in the, in the video itself. Um, and I'm sorry, I forgot it the first time. Okay, that's it.